Steve Kite, Chris Coleman, Channel 3 Outdoors. We're going to talk about live well management and keeping your fish alive today, and that's a must for the, today's tournament angler. Keeping your fish alive and good live well management is really simple. It's not a difficult task. You need ice, you need some additives, and you need a proper functioning live well. And then now we're going to actually show you how to prepare your live well to do this. One mistake people make is they wait till they catch a fish before they start filling their live well up and putting ice in there. Actually, as soon as you get your boat in the water, get your live well ready for a fish. Now we've got 30 gallons of water here, and so the rule is 10 pounds of ice per 15 gallons. So I've got 20 pound bag right here. I'm gonna add it, this whole 20 pound bag to the live well. And that's already starting to look much, much better. Then, I'm gonna follow the directions on the bottle for the amount of water. This is a product called Rejuvenate. There's several on the market, but I'm gonna put me two capfuls, and I don't have to go really crazy on this. Just simple, like that right there. I'm gonna pour this one over here where it gets mixed up real good. The water's turning nice and blue now. Now my main objective here is, let's say the water temperature is, well right now it's 88.7 degrees. I really want to shoot to 10, 10 degrees below that. If I can keep this water somewhere around 78, that is the ideal situation for the best survival rate of my catch for today. Okay, after we've got this water ready and some time has gone by, um, we're going to have to add ice again several times during the day depending on the conditions. And a good way to do that is frozen bottles anywhere from gallon milk jugs, quarts, even this size Coke bottle right here, and just drop these in the live well periodically at different times during the day to maintain that cool water. Uh, I would recommend changing the water at least every four hours. But that kind of depends on uh, how much waste you got from the fish. I'm pretty much looking at the condition of the water. This water looks really good right here. It's not used. Uh, after four hours, it's not gonna look quite this well. And as time goes on, it's gonna keep deteriorating. So uh, leave your aerators running wide open. Do not put it on time. It is way too hot. 88 degree water temperature requires full circulation plus a lot of attention and a lot of ice. Good live well management and fish care is gonna really give your fish a big huge chance of surviving after the end of a tournament day. So give yourself an advantage, give your fish advantage. Practice good live well management and fish care.